Okay, fellas, I have the Milwaukee battery, and this one was mm, damaged by the car tire. The car run on the battery, and it's not accepting charge anymore. So, uh, okay, what we have here, we have the new controller here. And basically you can see it's a screw here and we have connection here and here. Okay, got a small screw. What can we see here? You can see that we need to unsolder this two parts, this one, this one, and probably this one. Let's make check for the screw here. And you can check where it holds. Okay, got it. So I have my thermal protection. Now you can see maybe there's something bad on the PCB. You cannot see anything with the blind eye, naked eye. <coughs> okay. So what we want to do here, we want to put this controller in the place of the old one. Yeah, okay, it shows three or four. Of course, it's not touching everything good, so... Okay. Yeah, this one seems to be good. Now I will solder everything. Okay, <clears throat> seems that I have soldered all the parts here, yeah, the lights are working, so now I need to spot weld these two plates and we'll check how I can push them a little bit more, yeah, this one will be good. Okay. 
a little bit big. Not bad. Okay, with this one I will be in a trouble. I need to get it to hold like that. Now it's not holding. Of course, as you can see, it's. I'll try to focus somehow. It's bended here, so I need to bend it to the good position. Okay, now still cannot get it welded. Honestly, I don't know why. Maybe because my maybe because my spot holder is very shitty. I will try to take down the tiny mixed plate. I will cut it and I will try to spot weld it on top of this. Because I still want to check if the controller is working and, uh, and so on. So, and I don't know then if everything is working. Probably I will be needed to bring this battery to someone who have the good professional spot welder. I think so. This one holds now. Yep, this one now holds. So I will connect the other end. Okay, I have spot welded the uh, ends and uh, are, I'm happy with the result, no? Of course I'm not happy with that result and uh, okay, but the good sign is that the free lights is turning on here, so I will try to put a cover on the battery. Okay, so I forgot to put the screws on the board. and one longer one okay now we can close the Get the screws in. Will not tighten them because still I need to get this battery to someone who have the good spot welder to make a good weld of it. One of the corners here are broken, so the screw will not hold here. This 
one too. Okay, and the house is really bad, but don't mind things. What we want to know if this battery can be charged. Yep, it's charging and probably it will charge, so no error, that's good. And yep, you've seen how to change the PCB for the Milwaukee battery by repairing it. Just get the better spot welder than I have and you will be fine with this process with all the steps. Thank you for watching and for now just bye.